They're off. They've jumped away. But a ragged start for one or two of these. Garal Sahaya was a bit behind them when they broke. And also great news walked out of the stalls towards the outside. One that got out well was Besht Alakem. Loves the trailblazers up there. The grey in the centre of your shot. Towards the outside up there too is the 14 Urta phase. Not that far away either. 16's up with the gallop as well. Rual Saudia from the outside stalls. It's a five-way go for the lead here. Real speed burn-up going on. Besht Alakem on the inside. Right up there too is Rual Saudia in the green colours. Towards the extreme outer trying to press forward is Shibal Omar. That one though is out on the top shelf and happy to cover a lot of extra ground. Gar Al Sahaya blew the start, but is now improving. It's going to sit in about fifth place as they make the turn. And they're on from Kadea, who is in, head, in turn ahead of Estiv Zar as they make the turn. Still, Besht Alakem, Nayef Adonazi, has certainly set his stall out in front, leads by a length now. Here comes some challenges, though, towards the outside. Kilaska Faye is in second place. And down the outside, then, we have Urta Faye as well, trying to get closer. The inside runner is Gar Al Sahayev in the black sleeves and cap, who's just short of room there, has to check off heels. Down the straight they come, Kilaska is down the outside now trying to challenge this leader but Besht Alakem keeps fighting more in front and still leads for Nayef Adonazi Besht Alakem by a length and a half now Kilastafe keeps wanting to hang in behind and Besht Alakem is going to make most tough effort up with the pace throughout there was no hiding place it's a winner for Nayef Adonazi Besht Alakem tight for second maybe just Kilastafe ahead of in third place Gar Al Sahayev who missed the start ran on well Tom Collins at the double he's flying again Normal service resumed here on the uh, JCSA English-speaking service. Number three, the winner, Besh.